Hello, my internet friends. I'm Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions. This is number 15 in our 20 days of Chief Architect X15, the new version here. And today's video highlights the new feature of our ability to sort schedules. Yes. So let's jump in to Chief Architect X15. Yes, here we go. I am really excited about this. In the past, what I've had to do when I have my door and window schedules, I like to sort them by floor from the foundation at the top to first floor to second floor, etc. And then I try to sort by interior, exterior. Now, at this point, we can only sort by one, one column at a time. So we're going to go through a couple different ways and see if we can't get this to do it for us automatically. If nothing else, um, we have improved, uh, I think, by quite by quite a bit. So I've got a couple of window uh, uh, schedules here. Uh, of course, windows are typically on just the exterior walls. Um, and so let's select my window and you'll notice new uh, new uh, tools, new control tools. We can always uh, use these right here to size the columns width wise. You can use these tools to drag up and down and re relocate that window unit. Say if you wanted three up in number one, drag this up here and then these would go to one would go to two and two would go to three and three would go to one, etc. Um, you can drag this handle and move it, you know, different locations in the in the schedule, move that column all together. We now have this tool right here, this uh, triangle that can sort the column. So instead of zero, one, zero, 2 and 1, I want to show zero, 1 and 2. Let's sort by floor. And this operation turns on automatic sorting. With automatic sorting on, the schedule will reorder itself and you will lose the current ordering. Would you like to turn on automatic sorting and continue with the operation? Let's go ahead and continue. And let's click it one more time. And it will, instead of 210, it will now sort from lowest to highest, highest to lowest, lowest to highest. Now, let's zoom in on this. You see the red that turned red instead of gray. So this is the highlighted sorting and uh, it changed directions. Let me click it one more time and notice it's down. Interesting, all of them turn down as I click that and then all of them turn up. As I click, but this red one is the active sorting number. Let's see if it, uh, yeah. So you can sort by f if you open this schedule specification, you can automatically sort by floor for ascending or descending, right? All right. So if it's automatically sorting, and I go back in here and I put Let's say, let's say this window, that didn't add a, an extra window. Let's add a couple windows in here. That didn't add one either. Let's make this super wide. So see it automatically moved If I delete this, the windows on floor number two are, win are W03. If I add this here and make this uh, W03 now in floor number one, W03 for floor number two got, um, uh, got moved down to W04. All right, so let's so that that's good here right and in floor number one w02 and 03 would be bumped if we did this so 
So one and two are now on the basement level, three and four are now on the first floor, and five is bumped up. Uh, the, the windows on floor two are bumped up to W05. All right, let's do this. Let's see if we can't do this in the door schedule. I'm going to try doing sorting the interior exterior column and then the floor column, and let's see what happens. So I'm going to click on the down arrow for interior exterior, and we, yes, it's going to turn on automatic sorting. And I want exterior uh, located at the top. So I've got a um, I've got an exterior door on the foundation and first floor, and the rest of them are interior on all three levels. So now let's try this, go to floor, sort by floor. Ah, look at that. So if I sort the interior exterior first, and then the floor, it'll put the exteriors at the top of each floor line, and that's the way I want it. Um, I want the exteriors to lead with that floor, and then um, it's going to uh, move. So zero, zero, this is the foundation level, all the doors in the foundation level, all the doors in the first floor level, and then all the doors in the second floor level. Now, if I add an exterior door to the first floor, it's going to put it back at the bottom of first floor. So my exteriors aren't together for first floor. Um, I could manually drag this up, but that's gonna turn off automatic sorting. Uh, let's do this sort by interior exterior first. Sort and then floor. And now they're together. So quickly, we can do that. Now, if we wanted to um, manually move that, let's undo that. Uh, redo. There we go. Uh, if I move this up here, I'm going to imagine it's going to say, hey, you're, turning, you're manually moving it. Do you want to turn off automatic sorting? Yes. It, yeah, it uh, shows that, comes up with the same result visually on the page, um, but the automatic nature of it will turn off. So, there we go. Automatic sorting. You can only sort one at a time, uh, but you can sort one column and then the next to get it into the um, format, the the direction you want it to go uh, so that it's sorted quickly. Oh my goodness, this is going to save me so much time. The only thing after this is that I like to try to say start with the first the front door and um, let's let's throw in this as a front door. Now see that through that at the very bottom of the list altogether. So I'm going to do my sorting thing. Uh, exterior, interior, turn, yes, turn on. And then floor. And now my exterior doors now. So I like to have my front door be the um, leading door on that floor. Right, the, so that would be the first door on that floor going to turn off and then I'm going to go clockwise around the plan and start making these be um, so why is that's oh door number six I want to be that's the front door there's the front door so four five and six that works and then this would be seven and i'd like to make this let's make this a uh, hinge door just for giggles and so 10 would be number nine now yeah. 
I'm sorry, number seven. All right, and then so I do like to have some sort of so it's not just hodgepodge around the um, the door numbers aren't you know door number seven here and door number eight there and door number ten there and door number eleven there <laughs> um, on the plan so that there's some sort of work around. But this gets us this this interior exterior sorting and then floor sorting gets me so much closer. Um, I don't have to have to do that manually. In the past, I would do this manually all the all the doors and windows together for floor zero and then floor one and then floor two, etc. So that's an exciting new feature is sorting our uh, column in in schedules. All right. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this information and learn something new uh, or the series, click like and subscribe right down there and hit the notification bell so that you are notified each time I drop a video. Stick around for a few more days of Chief Architect X15 and do leave a comment. I enjoy the uh, interaction with you all. Thanks. And until next time, take care.